Hello, hello! Welcome to a new program of Tangerine TV. Are you ready? Today, we will be asking some English students some questions. General knowledge questions. You can also participate by answering the questions before we give the correct answer. Good morning. Excuse me. This is Tangerine TV. Are you an English student? Hello. Yes, I am. I study English in the institute placed at the corner. Why? Excellent. We are here to evaluate the level of English of the English students. We will ask you some questions, and if you answer most of them correctly, you'll win a prize. A prize? That's interesting. <laughs> What will I win? Money? It's a surprise. But tell us, do you want to evaluate your level of English with us? Sure, I am an upper intermediate student. I want to know if I am learning English well. All right, here comes the first question. How many points are there in a pair of dice? What? <laughs> oh, you got me there. I am terrible with numbers. I hate maths. But let me guess, is it 20? No, 30 and something. 32? No, I'm sorry. A pair of dice has a total of 42 dots. 21 on each die. Oh, I told you, I am terrible with numbers. Next question, please. All right. What is the only part of the body that is fully developed from birth? That's an interesting question. Um, let me see. Uh, the heart? No, it's not. The only part of the body that is fully developed from birth are the eyes. Seriously? Wow, I didn't know that. That's interesting. Next question. Yeah, the eyeball is the only organism which does not grow from birth. It is fully grown when you are born. Next question. What are you afraid of if you suffer from acrophobia? We're talking about phobias now? Damn, I watched that video on Tangerine Academy channel. Let's see. Is it fear of dogs? No, fear of the spiders? No, I don't know. Acrophobia is a mental health condition in which the individual experiences an intense fear of heights. Heights? Yeah, I knew it. I didn't rem remember that. <laughs> Next question, please. Okay, this question is about animals. How many hearts does an octopus have? I didn't even know the octopus had more than one heart. <laughs> so, I don't know. An octopus has not one, but three hearts. Two of them are the branchial hearts. And the third, or systemic heart, pumps the oxygenated blood around the body. Next question. About planets, which planet is closest to the sun? Um, that must be Jupiter, right? Or Venus? 
No, Jupiter, yeah. Um, no. Mercury is the planet closest to the Sun, while Neptune is the farthest one from the Sun. Yeah, sorry. I don't know much about planets. Next question. Alright. Where is the strongest human muscle located? Do you know? The strongest human muscle? Um, no. Again, I don't know. The leg? I'm afraid to tell you that's not correct. The strongest muscle in the human body is your jaw muscle. This thick cheek muscle near the back of your jaw opens and closes your mouth when you chew. Next question. What is the only continent that is part of the four hemispheres? Asia. I'm sure about it. Because it has some countries in Europe. Or not? No, it is Africa. Africa is the only continent that can be found in all four hemispheres. Portions of the continent are geolocated in the northern hemisphere, southern hemisphere, eastern hemisphere, and western hemisphere. It's good you to know that. Yeah, you're right. I should know that, but I'm learning a lot. Next, please. Next question. What is the only flag that does not have four sides? That's not possible. All the flags have four sides, all of them. So the answer is no one. That's not correct. The national flag of Nepal is the world's only national flag that is non-quadrilateral in shape. You can search that on the internet if you want. I believe you, but I will search that information anyway. <laughs> sure. Next question. In which country do you drink the most coffee? All right, that's very easy. Last year, my family and I went to South America. It is Colombia. Incorrect. Finland is the world's biggest consumer of coffee on a per-person basis. The average Finn drinks nearly four cups a day. Coffee is so popular in Finland that... Two 10-minute coffee breaks are legally mandated for Finnish workers, too. Seriously? I had no idea. But Colombian coffee is the best in the world. Probably. But that's a different question. I'm sure Colombian coffee is excellent. Next question. What sporting event has a strict dress code that requires wearing all white? All white? Well, I have seen many sports, but I guess it's tennis. Yes and no. I mean, to be exact, it is the Wimbledon. Next question. This is an easy one. In which city is the Disney theme park in Europe? <laughs> Seriously? My family and I went to Disneyland two years ago. Of course I know where it is. That's very easy. It is located in California. Next question. <laughs> California. 
But I said Europe. The Disney theme park in Europe is in Paris, France. Oh, how stupid I am. <laughs> I'm sorry. Next question, please. Sadly, we don't have time for more. But if you want another similar video, comment and like this video. Take care. I hope you liked this conversation. If you could improve your English a little more, please subscribe to the channel and share this video with a friend. And if you want to support this channel, you can join us or click on the super thanks button. Thank you very much for your support. Take care.